Hello everyone. Uh, today I want to show you the easiest recipe ever. It's the most requested recipe, believe it or not, is how to make tomato sauce. And uh, lots of people uh, try to do diff different things. Everybody has different re recipes, but this is a very straightforward and it's the most requested one. And everybody loves our tomato sauce that we use in our restaurants and the shop. Um, of course, the most important ingredient to do this uh, recipe is to use our Sardinian tin tomatoes uh, called Casa. They're absolutely brilliant. I mean, I, I know not everything Sardinia is the best, but this is very, very good. The, the, uh, uh, the other option you could have is the Chirio, they're called Chirio tomatoes. Uh, now I'm sure there's a lot of other, lots of others, but I, I don't know many, many, many tin tomatoes because I always use the same and I'm sure they, they're very good. So we have tin tomatoes and ingredients. We've got some garlic, olive oil, chili, if you wish, it's not uh, compulsory, salt and pepper, and believe it or not, there's a bit of sugar here. So I'm gonna start by chopping one uh, nice clove of garlic. I think one clove of garlic is enough for two tins of tomatoes. So I wouldn't exaggerate with garlic, but you know, this is the most important part. And by the way, just for another piece of information, this sauce, this tomato sauce can be made into different ways. You can, instead of chopping garlic, you could chop an onion and start with an onion instead of garlic. So, that's the other version, is it's sweeter version. This one I find is my favorite because it's a bit gassy, it's more, more taste and, and so on. So. so I'm gonna chop this garlic as fun as possible. Okay. And uh, are lots of friends out there which are who are going to appreciate this recipe because I've been asked so many times. My God, there's a lady who lives on the road. She said, I'll go to the shop and buy your tomato sauce. Actually, you know, you can actually buy the tin and make it yourself and it's easy. Okay, this will chop. And that's good enough. So now I'll show you how easy and how quick I'm gonna do this. Oops. Now my my stove, as you can see, it's got a pilot. This is the same industrial stove. And the pilot is, allows you to just turn it on and it goes on. It's a very special. So what I'm gonna do is this pot. The easiest way is to just cover the bottom with olive oil, not too much. And you put the flame on, heat up the oil. As I said, this stage, if you want, you put some chili. And then I'll put the garlic in straight away. I'm not going to wait until the oil gets hot because it cooks. You have to be very careful not to burn the garlic. So that's done. Okay, so this is the garlic that is frying and in the olive oil, as you can see, a little bit of garlic with olive oil. Doesn't, obviously, you've got to make sure it's not burnt. It's quite, be careful because it's very easy to burn it. In fact, this flame is a bit too high now. I'm going to turn it down to the lower part because this sauce has got to be cooked in a low heat. Okay, so that's, now what we're going to do we're just going to chuck the tomato inside. Wait another second. So you can see the garlic and the oil is going to impregnate and then flavor the, the olive oil. Okay, so now we chuck, we put in one and two. So I'm gonna, I, I put a bit of water in the tin and then just rinse it a little bit. Keep that little water and just add it here anyway, just, just to not to waste it. So now 
Now we're going to get into C minor, okay? Before we do that, I want to add some salt. Okay, you can always add more later. And some pepper. Okay, so I'm going to be Believe it or not, using a, a teaspoon of sugar because this is get rid of the acidity of the tomatoes. It's just a little teaspoon of sugar. Doesn't it? Doesn't need much. Just that, maybe a little bit more because this spoon is quite small. And that's all. That's all you need to do. Okay. Now this is a, all you need. Now to make things easier, I got this type of utensil that you use to mash potatoes, and what you do, you're gonna squash all these tomatoes that are in there so they cook, cook much quicker. Okay, I'm going to show you what you should do while you prepare the tomatoes is just squish, squash all the tomatoes properly with this utensil that you use to mash the potatoes or whatever. So by doing this, it should help the sauce to be fun and cooked. So basically, believe it or not, that's all there is to do. There's only three ingredients. Olive oil, garlic, and tin tomatoes. It's just the way you process them. I'll leave that on. Keep it on low, on very low heat. I would say 20 minutes, maybe a bit more, but you can see the intensity. After 20 minutes, taste, the longer it takes with a slow heat, the better it is, to be honest. Um, so and that's a basic tomato sauce. And remember that you can always have the other option. Instead of using garlic base, you can do onion base, in which case you will put a, a bay leaf inside as well. And, uh, and it makes it a little bit sweeter than, than this one with garlic. And that's it. That's the plain, fresh tomato sauce you would use with spaghetti, with penne, with whatever. And you add chili if you want to make it spicy. And that's it for today. Thank you. Goodbye.